Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Studios. Today in this video, I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to start your PlayStation 5 into safe mode. So let's go ahead and jump the video right now. Now, before we get started, we will need a USB to USB-C cable that we can connect to our PlayStation 5 and our controller. So go ahead and get that. Now on your PlayStation 5 itself, we need to completely turn this off and shut it down. You can do this by pressing the PlayStation button on, on your controller and then going to the power option and then going to shut off or turn off or hold down the power button and continue to hold it down. You will hear one beep and then you will hear another beep. Then it will completely shut down and there will be no lights emitting or flashing. So now that the PlayStation 5 is completely turned off, locate the power button. The power button is the button that's closest to the side on the bottom of the console. So go ahead and hold that down. You will hear one beep. Then you will hear another beep about five to six seconds later. So when you hear that second beep, go ahead and let go of the power button. And your PlayStation 5 will then start into the safe mode menu. Take your cable and plug it into the front USB. Then take your PlayStation 5 controller and plug it in. Then press the PlayStation button to operate the menu. Now in the menu, we will have various different options like restart your PlayStation 5. You can change the video resolution. Then you have update system software, restore default settings, Clear cache and rebuild the database on your PlayStation 5. Then you can completely reformat and reset your PlayStation 5. And then reset PS5 and reinstall system software. So those are all the options available for you guys in case you are having hardware issues with your PlayStation. So if this video did indeed help you guys out, go ahead and leave it a big thumbs up. And subscribe to my channel down below for more tech help videos coming up next on Your 6 Studios.